What's up, chicas? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Frances Michelle. If you're tuning in for the first time, I have to say welcome to my channel. Super happy that you're here. Stoked that you clicked on that link and you want to watch my video. So before we get into this video and what this video is all about, don't forget to hit subscribe. Yes, yes, yes. Because if you click the video, it's because... <laughs> I don't know. You want to see me and you want to see more of me. So just hit subscribe down there and we can move on and we can be best friends. So in today's video, it's going to be my top pick. Um, I try rounding out to at least 10, so it's pretty much my top 10 drugstore favorites. Um, I just finished, I just did a like what's new makeup, must have and all that, but I kind of incorporated everything. I kind of did skincare, hair, everything, and there was a lot of high-end products. But I feel like I'm more of a drugstore type of girl. I love drugstore products. And lately, there's been a lot of new drugstore products out there that have not ceased to impress me. So I wanted to give you guys my absolute favorite drugstore products at the moment. This is just a beauty edition. I will do skincare and hair care on a different video. Without further ado, if you guys want to see what my top 10 products, drugstore picks, you're gonna look bomb and you're not gonna break the bank. All you have to do is keep on watching. Okay, so let's get started with face products. So I am going to first talk about primers that I have been obsessed with and I've loved. And honestly, I am a high-end primer girl. I like my primers to be high-end because I feel like if it's not high-end, then it ain't worth it. But actually, these primers kind literally change my mind and thought about primers. So I want to talk to you guys about Cover Girl. I have to say, CoverGirl has definitely blown my mind with their new products, like legit. So I want to talk to you about these primers. There's actually four. I couldn't find the other one. But these are the primers. They are brand new. This is what the primers look like. So we have four in this category. We have the Pore Minimizer, which is my absolute favorite. If you're looking to uh, minimize your pores, if you have like enlarged pores and you just like, and you don't want to break the bank with the pore, um, with the pore refining by Benefit or Smashbox, because I feel like they're my top ones, then this one, girls, I highly recommend it. It's so good, guys. Like legit, it's so so good. Um, I don't know how much they range for because I did receive it as a PR gift from CoverGirl, but I will definitely put a link down below. They do have them at Ulta, and I did see them at Walmart as well. They also have the illuminating. I have not used the illuminating one. Neither I have used the color neutralizing. But that's awesome because if you're looking to have like illumination on your um, foundation, then I feel like you can definitely use this one. And if you have problems with um, ro rosacea, rosacea, hopefully I'm saying it right, you have like a lot of red spots and all that, you can definitely, definitely use the color neutralizing, which is a green um primer and then we have the other one which is the skin soothing so i'm trying to find it because i want to mix the pore uh, minimizer and the skin soothing because if the pore minimizer like legit makes my pores disappear i cannot imagine how my skin is going to look with the skin the skin um what did i say <laughs> the skin soothing so moving along to foundation I have to say that one of my holy girl foundations at the moment is going to be, again, CoverGirl, their new True Blend Matte Made Foundation. Oh my god. I am super obsessed with this foundation, guys. Like, coverage for me is like full coverage. Legit for me is full coverage. It does say it's a full coverage formula, if I'm not mistaken. It's a comfort matte finish oil free formula pump application included um it actually doesn't say that it's a full coverage foundation anywhere but i feel as it is i feel like it gives me that full coverage flawless looking finish and i love it because it's matte but at the same time it's not like drying my skin and hello dry skin right here our day okay all the time my skin is super super dry and i use matte foundations and this foundation right here look you can see i don't look dry whatsoever i really don't so guys honestly speaking if you have not yet to try this foundation i highly recommend it if you're looking for a matte foundation full coverage and it's legit like long wear i highly recommend this foundation like 
Then the other one from the drugstore that I am obsessed with that I, of course, mix together. It's the... There we go. It's the CoverGirl... Oh, no, no, no. It's the Maybelline Superstay Full Coverage 24-Hour Foundation. This one right here. I did try the... Um, I did try this thick, ladies, but I have to tell you, honestly speaking, I feel like coverage-wise, this for me is bomb.com. The other one was great, but I felt it was more like a medium coverage. Like, if you're looking for a medium coverage, then that'll be a great foundation for you. But if you want more like a full, full-on coverage, gonna last you all day as well, then I recommend picking up the liquid one because I feel like this one is just amazing. Like, these two foundations come... Foundations. <laughs> These two foundations um, mixed together are like oh, match made in heaven. If you have not yet to try any of these foundation, you are legit missing out. You can't go wrong. They're less than 12 bucks and honestly speaking, the formula on these things are like amazing. Like I'm impressed. Like legit, I'm impressed. And I am a foundation girl. Like I have a full drawer of foundation and I cannot get enough of foundation. Like a foundation comes out and I read all the reviews and I'm like, I need it. I'm more of a foundation girl. So I'm more, I've tried a lot of foundations, especially from the drugstore. So guys, if you have not tried any of those two foundations, you're living under a rock. That's all I'm saying. So then from CoverGirl as well, I'm, I'm telling you, CoverGirl, ooh, just put my nail in it. <laughs> Sounded like a turkey. So, my kids are watching. They're like, Ma, what the hell? So, the other thing from CoverGirl is their CoverGirl Vitalist Healthy Powder. I am not a powder girl, but ever since I tried this powder, ah, butter, and I love how smooth it makes my skin look like hell yes this is what it looks like it's also from their new um, their new line there we go and i absolutely 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 love this powder it's not cakey it doesn't give you like that cakey or like powdery looking skin like oh girl you got a lot of powder on you no none of that you don't get none of that none of that with this None of it. So this powder right here is super good, and again, it's from the drugstore. Is isn't everything you're talking about from the drugstore? Okay. Oh, another thing. I'm telling you, CoverGirl blew it out of the park. Honestly, with their new products from the drugstore this year, summer collection just blew my mind. The other thing I've been loving, and actually, I don't have the um. It's gonna be. We're gonna talk about powder. I'm sorry, we're gonna talk about brow product, girl. Oh my god. <sighs> when you're pregnant and you have to bend down and pick things from the floor, it's not fun. I feel like lately, drug brow products, if they're not high end, they're in popping. And let me tell you, that ain't true. Look at my brows. My brows ain't that bad. My brows have come a long way and it's because I've been using the CoverGirl brow product. I've been using their CoverGirl Define Pencil and to fill them in, I've been using their pomade. Like, oh, guys, legit amazing. Like, honestly speaking, you don't have to spend $18 on a wand or $18 on a pomade to get flawless looking brows all right honey okay okay so this right here are like my best friend i've already used three pencils and i'm about to be on my fourth one because i'm truly obsessed with these two things so these two things here are bomb.com like my brows my brows don't go anywhere all day all day girl i got you i got you i'm telling you you're gonna look flawless, hot, slain on a budget without breaking your bank, okay? To blush and highlight. So the next one is this blush. I have to say, I've only tried this one, but if all the other ones in her line and are as pigmented and beautiful as this one, I don't know what I'm missing on. But I have to do, I have to share the Flower Beauty by Drew Barrymore. It's available at Walmart and also it's available now at Ulta, Ulta Beauty. 
the one spot for beauty. <laughs> this color is the peach primrose. I feel it's a beautiful peachy color. It was perfect now for summer. I'm gonna see if she has like more of a mauvey color now for fall because that's what I'm into. But I feel like Milani had great, great um blushes up until Physicians Formula created their butter blushes, which were like bomb.com. But then I tried this one and I was just like, girl. This is as good as, as, as good as, I don't know, any blush. And for highlight, I was like, what? Lies. When I saw it online, people were swatching it, and I received it as a pure gift, I was like, let me go grab that box. I was like, what? What? Guys, these little things by Pixie Beauty have legit changed my mind about highlighting from the drugstore yes yes babe these two they're called glowy gloss middle duo glowy, i don't know they're just gluey glue glowy duo oh my god one is the color subtle sunrise and then the other one is color drew delicate drew delicate dew i can't read I'm gonna swatch these out for you guys real quick because I do have to. I feel like I have to. Oh, can you guys? Oh, can you guys see that though? Can you guys see? Look at that! Look at that! I'm flipping my arm. No, maybe this way is better. Look at that though. You see that? That's Pixie, girl. That is from Tarjay. You go to Tarjay and you're gonna find it there. And I'm just so impressed. I'm not even like kidding, guys. Like, legit. I'm gonna add one more thing that I'm not supposed to add. But now that we're in the video, <laughs> I fooled you, Nessa Tan, and they're like 30. <laughs> Are also from Pixie Beauty, and they're their liquid glow eyeshadows. Oh my god. Honey, look at that. You see that? My big old face is in the way always. Do you see that? That is Pixie. That is Tarjay. So if you're into the whole um glittery shadows, girl, Pixie gotcha. Alright, so following along, the next thing will be Pixie. Um, this is a Pixie liner. I've been obsessed with this liner. It's a dual liner. You get the liquid you get the liquid liner on one side. Doo -doo -doo -doo. And also you get a black hole liner on the other one. So you get both of both of the both both the best worlds in one line in one whole liner and I love it because I can take it with me. I can do my cat eye on the top and then I can use this for my waterline and it's like we're done. Okay, so how many things have I talked about? Alright, so the last two things guys to wrap it up. And our lip products. Cover girl blew it for me this year when it came to the drugstore. Their liquid lipsticks, these ones right here, mostly this ones. If you see these at the drugstore, pick them up. You won't be sorry. These are called the Melting Pout Matte. I absolutely love these colors. Super pigmented, super soft, and it does not dry your lips at all whatsoever they have beautiful beautiful shades guys beautiful shades these two right here are one of both of my favorite shades at the moment they're just so velvety they have like a velvety feel look how pretty those colors are guys those colors are very very pretty so they are really really good and last but not least lately i've been into contouring my lips meaning i've been into eyeliner eyelining lining out my lips trying to make my lip look like i got botox <laughs> um one is pregnancy lips look it up there actually is an actually real thing there's pregnant women who get big old now nose and there's pregnant women who get big lips i was able to get the big lips hello Oh, so I have been obsessed with these two brand of lip liners like drugstore wise they actually blew it better than NYX for me honestly speaking yes I just said that they're so creamy and they glide on so easily you will be very impressed they are the cover girl exilier 
I like exhibitionist liners. There's eight liners in that collection. And I only brought seven. I'm missing one. This is what they look like. These are the cover girl. This. They have a, cute, a very good range of colors. They have very light nude, nude, red, burgundy, and they have pink and um, brown. So they have a good white range of colors. And like I said, they're very, very um, smooth. They glide on so easily. And then the other one is from Flower Beauty. They also have a few of them. These are the ones I picked up. They have a few of them and they are also very pigmented and they glide on like butter and they stay on. They don't make your um, lipstick bleed or anything. I absolutely love it. So guys, I hope you liked the video. If you did like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you have not yet to subscribe to my channel, make sure you do hit that button before you go and turn your notifications on because I am raining videos on your feed like crazy. Yes, videos. That's right. And you don't want to miss any other videos. So thank you guys so much for your love. Thank you guys so much for your support. Thank you so much for sticking till the end. Muchos besos. I'll see you ladies on my following video. Adios.